it's Ray from Philly on Saturday night, April 1st. It's also April Fool's Day, uh, 2017. And um, I got a package in, uh, in the mail the other day from Sirius Sports Cards. Uh, it's one of my favorite auction houses that I use outside of eBay. Um, with eBay, I usually go to either PWCC or Probstein most of the time. But outside of eBay, I really like... Um, serious sports cars and clean sweep auctions so here's a flyer that I got in the package if you guys want to check it out it's serious sports cards and it's two cards for the 300 great baseball cards of the 20th century by Mike Payne so got a double header going here now and before I registered these cards I'm ranked 14th on that PSA set registry and um, I think this bumps me up to 13th. I don't know. As of right now, I don't know. I haven't registered the cards yet, but before I post this video, I'll register the cards first and I'll post it down below in the notes to see if to let you guys know if it uh, has bumped me up. So, without further ado, let's show the two cards. Really nice looking cards. First is a 1959 Topps George Anderson which you guys might know as Sparky Anderson. And why don't I just grab the camera here to give you guys a closer look of these great cards. Okay, like I said, the first one is a 59 Tops George Sparky Anderson in a PSA 5. It's a mid-level grade, but the card centering, as you can see, is pretty, pretty good. No dings on it, no creases. The back looks really, really well. I love the little cartoon thing here on the side. His high school team won 42 straight games. What, what, winning is a habit. I don't know, I can't even see it. His high school team won 42 straight games. Winning is a habit. Okay, don't really get it, but... Sparky Anderson, as you know was more so in the Hall of Fame, I guess, because of his managerial with the Big Red Machine. <laughs> Not so much as playing. And I, if you notice, it is, he was with the Phillies. The other card is the from the 64 Tops. This is a 1964 Tops. Tops in the National League, Hank Aaron and Willie Mays. This is a great card. This is a, also an excellent five. Centering on this is really, really good. These cards really shouldn't be, uh, in my opinion, <laughs> shouldn't be fives on this at all. They have a price sticker on the back of this. So let me try and get that off. There's the back of the card. Too long to read, so I won't read that. But this is a sweet looking card. There you have, these are two, my two pickups for the 300 great baseball cards of the 20th century. And as, uh, as customary here on the Ray from Philly show with my 300 great cards, I'll read the excerpt from the book as to why that card is part of the set registry. Uh, it says here, the 59 tops George Anderson. George Anderson spent one season in the big leagues, but he didn't hit a home run in the 477 at-bats he lodged in 1959. He, oh, he came close. I took Don Drysdale deep, Anderson once told a throng of reporters. When eyebrows raised in amazement, Anderson delivered the kicker, just fail. But a sparky Anderson, he, for, he forged a Hall of Fame career that saw him win more than 2,000 games and capture World Series titles with the Cincinnati Reds and the Detroit, Detroit Tigers. That's no joke. So as like I said, he, he had a great career based on his managerial skills. That's why he's in this uh, set registry. Let's page forward and look for the 64 tops in the National League card. This is a really nice card. Um, it says here, 1964 tops, tops in National League, Aaron and Mays, card number 423. Tops in National League, how about tops in big league history? These two combined for 1,415 home runs. Aaron 755, number one all time. Of course, this book was written in 99. May 660, number three all time. That's a lot of souvenir baseballs rattling around the bleachers. So there you have it. That's 
the two cards for this pickup today for the 300 great baseball cards of the 20th century by Mike Payne. Great cards, great classic cards here. Can't wait to register these tonight to see if I get moved up a little bit. Hopefully maybe from 14 to 13. But, um, you know, the, the, the centering on the Sparky Anderson. 59 Tops is a beautiful card to begin with. Well, there you have it, the 59 Tops, George Sparky Anderson, and a 5, and the 64 Tops, Tops in National League, Hank Aaron and Willie Mays. So let me know what you guys think. Uh, appreciate all your comments. I'm at currently 299 subscribers. I'm one subscriber away from the magic number of 300. So thanks again, all you guys, for all your support. And there you have it. I'll let you guys know if I move up in the rankings. But uh, thank you very much, and uh, have a good night. Bye-bye.